What's up, YouTube? Simply unluckier. And today we have one of the most epic classic products of all time from 2003, the Yu-Gi-Oh! Starter Deck Joey Deluxe Edition. And then I want to ask you guys to check out the channel and subscribe for some more awesome Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. You guys, this is going to be crazy. I'm so excited to pop this open. And uh, yeah, so with the Legendary Decks 2 coming out very soon, you know, you have Starter Decks in there supporting Yugi, Kaiba, and Joey. And so I thought with us doing Worlds Collide, if you guys don't know what that is, definitely check it out. It's the Legendary Collections, uh, Joey vs. Yugi. It's going to be awesome. The duel will be very, very soon. I believe I'm going to do the video before the Legendary Decks 2 come out, and that's in just a few days. So it'll be very soon. But yeah, I thought, why not, you know, support Joey a little more and open one of his most awesome products. The classic, the amazing, the Starter Deck Deluxe Edition. Wow. I'm super excited to pop this open. I believe I opened it um, around four or five years ago, you guys. Like, I don't want to hurt the box. Um, but yeah, it's crazy. Because this is just from 2003. And um, yeah, so here comes the wrapping. As you can see there, Deluxe Joey includes one Starter Deck Joey, two Labyrinth of Nightmare Booster Packs, 50 Silver Metallic Card Sleeve Protectors. So, but yes, can't get enough of the Joey right now. And thanks to our friends at Ultra Pro, you guys here, we have the awesome, is it wrong to pick up girls in a dungeon playmat with Hestia and Belle. Little cuties. And wow, look at that, you guys. A brand new Starter Deck Joey Deluxe Edition. Crazy. I just want to like sit here and look at this forever. All right, we're going to have to take a whiff of this when we pop it open. So let's do it. Here we go. <sighs> from 2003 that air wow look at that you guys a starter deck joey in mint condition that is awesome two labyrinth of nightmare booster packs with a classic konami symbol you know these are really old yeah, I, I need i need another whiff <laughs> but here is the sleeves look at that those old classic sleeves there 50 sleeves and here is the Joey Deluxe, or Joey Regular Star Deck, and then uh, your Dual Tools. Here's your Dual Tools to be a better duelist. Telling you those original, those booster packs. So when this came out, how many booster packs were out? I think that's it. Pharaonic Guardian, you guys. Pharaonic Guardian was the most recent set. Crazy. Wow. Dual Tools. <laughs> Very awesome. And there's the other Deluxe Edition Pegasus. Might be opening that soon, you never know. Alright you guys, so we're going to take our time opening up this epic classic product here. Because um, it's just, it's not very often we get to open something so nostalgic. And so before we get to the Labyrinth of Nightmare packs though, let's check out the back of the Star Deck here. So it says, in ancient Egypt, there existed a force so powerful, it had to be locked away for a millennia. Now one boy has released the power. It's time to do Objective. In the Yu-Gi-Oh! trading card game, two players face off in an all-out battle, engaging in a match consisting of three duels. It will take skill, practice, strategy, and luck to emerge victorious from the match, as there are many factors players can manipulate to vanquish their foe. Main battles are waged between incredible monsters split into amazing 20 types, each with their own unique skills and fighting styles. In addition, players can use magic, set traps, change the battlefield itself, and even fuse two monsters together to form a monster of immense power. Awesome. It's time to duel. And before we open that up, though, let's pop these Labyrinth of Nightmare Booster Packs open. Alright, Joey. Let's see what you have to offer. Yo, Joey! Alright, the classic Konami Labyrinth of Nightmare Booster Packs. A portrait secret, a portrait cur cursed by the artist, is said to bring ill fortune to anyone who owns it. The Dark Door. Dream Sprite. That little cute fairy card there. And Humanoid Worm Drake. Jam Breeding Machine. I believe this was used to summon Ra, or it had, I think, a god card in uh, at least a couple episodes. But yeah, Jam Breeding Machine. Brings back memories. Awesome. Uh, the Earl of Demise. A gentle manly creature. Gentle manly creature is extremely wicked, feared by men and fiend alike. 
Soul of Purity and Light, Deal of Phantom, and Flying Fish. Three wishes are granted to those fortunate enough to see this monster in flight. Very awesome. And then for the second and final Lab of the Nightmare Pack of Destiny. Alright, Joey. Here we go. Can we get a foil, you guys, out of two packs? That would be insane. The Dark Door. Dream Sprite, Gravekeeper's Retribution, Gadget Soldier, a Rust Free Machine born to battle. And oh man, a super rare Fire Princess. Very nice, classic, beautiful card. The Fire Princess. Awesome. Pyro, inflict 500 direct damage to your opponent's life points each time you increase your own. That is amazing. Classic card there. And Worm Drake, once this monster wraps itself around a victim, there is no escape. Reminds me of Onyx. Amazon Archer, Blind, Destruction, and Scroll of Bewitchment. You won't hear names like that anymore. Very awesome classic cards. And we'll sleeve it up here with our Pro Fit Side Loaders. Very nice. Alright, you guys. So now I'm going to try my best to open up this Starter Deck Joey without really destroying the box. Alright you guys, so now that we've sleeved the amazing foil cards from this starter deck, we're going to have to take a whiff of this starter deck, so you guys are going to have to do it with me, because this, this smell is not a smell you can get every day. From 2003, the nostalgia. Wow. Alright. Change of heart, you guys. Wow, amazing, awesome card there. Select and control one opposing monster, regardless of position on the field, until the end of the turn. Oh man, Harpy's brother no longer has that name. It doesn't have Harpy's in its name. Before. I'm not gonna remember right now, but yeah, it was definitely changed. With eyes like a hawk and a flying speed exceeding Mach 5, this monster is a master of the sky. Got the mountain, malevolent and nuzzler, the seven colored fish, a rare rainbow fish that has never been cut by a mortal man. Uh, only the king of games. Dark Hole, classic awesome card. Block Attack. Masaki, the legendary swordsman. Legendary swords master Masaki is a veteran of over 100 battles. D Spell. Castle Walls. Thousand Dragon. Oh man, Time Wizard and Baby Dragon. Mahavelo from Magic Ruler. White Magical Hat. Dark Fire Soldier, an explosive expert with. A special elite force. The reliable guardian. Princess Surugi. 500 direct points of damage to your opponent for each magic and trap card on the field. Island Turtle. I used to love this card when I was a kid. It's a turtle and it's an island. A huge turtle that is often mistaken for an island. <laughs> Just Desserts. Flame Swordsman. Many people were very confused when this card came out on why it was a fusion. But okay. Uh, reinforcements of the army. That reminds me that they made the uh, the blue flame swordsman from the legendary collection. Just wanted to remind you guys, and I thought that was interesting. Which is just a four star eighteen hundred with a cool effect. So very nice. A reinforcements. Flame manipulator. The spellcaster attacks enemies with fire related spells such as Sea of Flames, Wall of Fire, Reverse Trap, Karate Man. Polymerization, nice. Seven tools of the bandit. Bandit Keith. Spirit of the heart. She soothes the soul with music from the heavenly heart. Ultimate offering is in here. 
Gearfried, the Iron Knight. Swordsman of Landstar, an amateur sword. With a sword, this fairy warrior relies on its mysterious powers. Remove Trap Armored Lizard. Dragon Treasure, Giant Trunade, Fake Trap, Mila Sur Radiant, Dian Keto the Cure Master. Is that a woman or a dude? A big Eye. It's the big old guy with a big old eye. If you remember that from the Legendary Collection, it's a real thing. Uh, Magician Faith. Sangan, the classic Sangan, when this card is sent from the field of graveyard, move one monster with an attack of 15 or less from your deck to your hand. Owa Boku, Eternal Rest, Baby Dragon for the polymerization. Where's that time wizard? Monster Reborn, classic and amazing. Trap Hole, Shield and Sword, Fisher, and the Almighty, the Time Wizard. Time Magic. So we have that polymerization and the time wizard with the baby dragon for the thousand dragon. All right, so we have the scapegoats coast to coast. Awesome card. Look at that beautiful straight from the starter deck. The penguin soldier. And this card is actually not bad against those extra cards, fusions and whatnot. Return two monster cards on the field to the owner's hand. The penguin soldier. She was actually not bad. She was used. Along with scapegoats. And the Vicious Dragon, the Ferocious Dragon, with the Deadly Attack. Red Eyes Black Dragon! Beautiful. What a star deck, you guys. I wanted you guys to post in the comments below if you'd like to see the original Starter Deck Joey versus the new Joey structure or star deck from the Legendary Decks 2 that will be opening in a few days. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. We could do a little Starter Deck battle. And yeah, but I'm super excited to pop up in that Legendary Dex 2 that's coming out very soon, you guys. It's going to have more support for Exodia for the Yugi deck in there, and that's going to be crazy. And, uh, wow. Awesome. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this classic, nostalgic opening of this amazing 2003 Joey Star Deck Deluxe Edition. Once again, YouTube, thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe for some more epic Yu-Gi-Oh videos and stay tuned for the finale the duel for worlds collide Yugi versus Joey and simply unlucky signing out oh baby